Gold medal match of the night, women's freestyle, 57 kilos. We talked about Japan, your team leader. They have two finalists tonight, the United States of America with three. They go toe to toe in two of the weights, including right here at 57, Helen Maroulis, the 30 year old. One of the marquee matchups of the night here at 57 kilos for gold medal. Helen Maroulis. Like I said yesterday, the Japanese women are all good in the legs and defending legs, but she's also good at the upper body. So I think that's the reason why we don't see so many shots right now. From Maroulis, Sakurai goes behind. Maroulis looked for a possible switch, couldn't find it. And Sakurai now creates in Japan. Sugumi Sakurai for the second straight year has won a world championship. Last year at 55, this year up a couple of kilos to 57. And I think 57 is also such a deep weight class. So great wrestlers with so many experience. And she's just 21. The trip around the center mat. They have gold medals at 50, 55, 62, 65. And now here tonight. match to dial in on as we move to gold medal Norway is in the house they are here and I think they're excited they should be because Grace Boulin is one of the more electrifying wrestlers Grace Boulin of Norway in the red two-time European champion Anastasia Nachita two-time continental champion as well including the reigning champion from earlier this year and there will be shot after and she shot. Can circle her knees out, really. Maybe an ill-advised shot there from Bulin. She was reaching, and these are the types of exchanges that Nishida just thrives in. Bulin forced it there. It wasn't. She overextended, and Bulin comes in. Sprawl back action by Nishida. Bulin slowly rising back up to her feet. Nishida not allowing her to. Step out of bounds, tried to hit an arm throw as they go caroling from Norway. So no points will be allowed, but they will start in parterre. If the she had to sweat it out, not just with the late offense from Bulan, but the long instant replay. It was one of the more exhilarating matches tonight. It came down to the wire, a challenge late. Anastasia Nachita earns the gold medal for gold medal number three, our ninth of 10 weight classes in women's freestyle, Japan and the United States. Ami Ishii, 19 years of age. She is the reigning U-20 world champion taking on the Olympic champion, Tamira Mensa Stock. It has been quite a senior level debut for Ami Ishii, 19 years old, already a U-20 world championship. And Mensa Stock, like she has the past couple of days, barreling her way in for two. Looking at you. There's a low shot by Ishii now. Smothered pretty easily by Mensa Stock, and look at the quickness, and now she sucks her back. And this is tight. Ishii trying to roll frantically. Mensa Stock looking for number two, and she has. In the next years again. One of the most contagious. The heart of a champion, and she is back atop the world here in 2022. And this she has for over 20 years, and you out. Oh. Just for two or three years, and I was, oh my God. <laughs> She's that good right now. How, how will she be in the future?
final two gold medals. Tamira Minsa stock. Ami Ishii of One Japan. One match remains. Kazakhstan, the United States. Gold medal here at 72 kilos. The number one seed has made her way through, and that is from Kazakhstan. The United States of America will come out in the blue. Kazakhstan back. Good job there by the American to swiftly go on the backside there for the go behind, trying to hook up a lace down low, an early 2 0 lead. Showing no nerves for being 18 years of age. She is so close to getting a turn. She gets one. And did she get a second? Yes, she did. She's looking for a third. And the world championship goes to Amina Lore. In under 90 seconds, a technical superiority win. Wow. And a storybook ending. I think she can, she didn't recognize really. Amita Lore, one of the young stars coming up. Now is her time. I'm